Yo, 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 it's surely being the place to be. Feeling young, feeling free. I hope you're doing well. Um, and these are some misconceptions debunked about Blink-182. So the first one is about Tom uh, being a bad singer. Actually, Tom is an amazing singer. He was a super strong, creative punk rock singer in his early days. His voice just began to weaken. Um, it was overworked. Well, at the same time, his vocal explorations expanded. That's why he struggled in the later live shows. But now his voice is recovering with angels and airwaves. Also, his lyrics are like super cool. Another misconception is that um, Travis is too good for the band. Um, Travis is an amazing drummer, but he's not the best thing in Blink. The best thing is all the parts of Blink combined. Blink would have been fine without the addition of Travis. Their stuff was great before Travis joined. That being said, Travis took the band into another dimension. Mark and Tom deserved Travis because they were making awesome music and Travis deserved Blink because he's such a talented drummer and fit in perfectly. Another thing is that in the later years Mark and Tom were, Tom were struggling to keep their vocal range intact whereas Tra Travis the athlete that he is has managed to maintain that. It's also difficult to keep your vocal range um, a dr as a drummer you just have to work your muscles but the the voice box is way more delicate especially if you're singing in a punk rock band which is super noisy okay so the next one is about Skiba fucking up Blink Skiba didn't fuck up Blink Skiba was a great addition with the band crumbling a bit and Tom giving his en energy into a angels and airwaves Skiba was a refreshing addition more reliable and more conventionally operative punk rock guitarist and singer. Skiba gave Blink-182 an extra boost, allowing the band to have a final win and release two more great albums. Skiba was different to Tom. Of course, people are nostalgic for Tom, but he just wasn't available, scattered, experimental, wild vocals, inconsistent. Skiba was just what Blink needed, and I'm sure Mark and Travis enjoyed the change. <laughs>